think it's to the point where when a coach or a school allows you, you know, to slack or not give it your best or not go 100%, they're kind of cheating you. You know, uh, Coach Chris Ball talks about all the time that if you were to let us, you know, take days off, you know, not go hard, it'd be a good service. What's up, Kayvon? My name's Orlando. I'm with the uh, NBC affiliate in Portland. Uh, just growing up, being from the West Coast, it just seems like it's it hits different. Uh, the Rose Bowl. What is it like for you? Can you just describe what the Rose Bowl meant to you growing up here in California? I mean, the Rose Bowl has always been a big deal. I've only been able, I've never been to a Rose Bowl game, but I've been to a UCLA game, you know, in the Rose Bowl. And it's a big stadium. It's, you know, an opportunity of a lifetime. I mean, I'm excited. You know, it means more to me now than it did, you know, when I was a kid because I wasn't really, you know, in tune to, how, to the greatness of it. But, I mean, I'm nothing but excited now. What has this ride been like you in your freshman year to be able to set these really high expectations and ultimately achieve them so early on? I mean, it's been a blessing. You know, we work, we go to work every day, and we actually, you know, put it, put the work in. So I'm happy that we've been able to accomplish, you know, a lot of things. And I can only hope that we keep going. You have so many seniors on this team that uh, went through a lot of ups and downs within this, uh, within Oregon. Does that add a little bit more for you, a little more motivation to want to win that last game for them knowing that this is their final game as a duck? I mean, we're trying to leave the legacy off, right? So um, that's been the whole goal. You know, we, we preach about being 1-0, and God will be 1-0 come uh, Wednesday. Appreciate you.